That's right, Yuna, the Razorback baseball team is in the middle of a nine game road trip and they took on the Florida Gators today. Now, Florida lit up the hog starting pitcher Isaiah Campbell with a grand slam in the first inning and the Gators bats were just firing on all cylinders from there on out. The Hogs bats, however, were silent compared to their recent explosions of offense, with this being the only spark coming off of Grant Cox's two-run home run in the fourth inning to avoid the shutout. The Gators would win this one 17-2 to even the three-game series at one apiece, so the rubber match will be tomorrow morning at 11. And the Arkansas softball team hosted Missouri today, and they set an attendance record with 2,756 people out at Bogle Park. Mizzou tacked on their third run of the day off a single pass third base to make it three to nothing. However, the Razorbacks would threaten in the bottom of the inning, but would eventually ground out into the third out and end that threat. Mizzou would shut Arkansas out today, handing the Razorbacks their first home loss this season. Game three of the series with Missouri is scheduled for 1 p.m. tomorrow. And of course, there's plenty of March Madness to catch up on. Florida State and Michigan just wrapped up to decide who will fill spot number two in the Final Four. The Wolverines won it with a final score of 58 to 54. And in the early game today, the upset machine that is Loyola Chicago rolled through Atlanta. Kansas State just could not keep up with the Ramblers 57% shooting, while the Wildcats only hit 35% of their shots. So the Ramblers out of the Missouri Valley Conference are heading to the Final Four for the first time since 1963 when they won their last championship. They will take on Michigan next Saturday. And finally tonight, the Razorbacks gymnastics team placed first in the opening session of the SEC championship, but ended up in fifth place overall. Today's 196.425 score is the second highest in program history and marks the program's highest finish in the championship since 2011 when they finished in fourth place. Now, the gymbacks will just have to wait until Monday afternoon for the NCAA regional selection show, which will air on NCAA.com. 4029 News will be right back.